All right, you already know. So Tank Davis versus Lamont Roach is scheduled for Saturday, March 1st. Uh, 2025 and they had their official press conference day at the bradley center in new york now something i did hear that tank caught me off guard was he said he's, he's going to retire and i know he's been saying that for a minute he said he had a hit list devin haney and shakur stevenson was supposed to be on this list but so far he's opened up with lamont roach and he said by 2025 well in, in 2026 which he got what four six fights i think a six fight deal so I don't know. Hope we can get the fights we want to see. He started off kind of sluggish. I don't know. He seemed like he was tired or whatever. I'm talking about Javante Tank Davis. And uh, him and Lamont Roach was talking. They was being cordial. Then somebody from Lamont Roach team started talking. And Tank got fired up. They start going back and forth. And Tank said he's going to knock him out within nine rounds. And uh, he better pretty much move his head. And I mean, you know, just a little trash. So I'm going to put the link to the description below. Yeah, look, uh, Javante said he admitted that that Lamont got some got sneaky power and they grew up together or they came up in um, amateurs together. So, I mean, it's cool to see at least these two brothers go out there and about to go get a payday. I mean, overall, I think the I think the think it was a pretty decent press conference. Uh, the fight is three months away, so I wouldn't expect them to go up there and uh, get in each other's faces. I'm sure it'll happen maybe the next couple of press conferences or you know they're gonna hype it up right before the fight you know uh that Javante tank davis he gonna tackle lamont roach and then of course everybody gonna order the pay-per-view let me say this though i honestly could lamont roach upset Javante tank davis yes yeah, possible but you gotta think he he has to move up and Javante tank davis has fought at 135 pounds and 140 pounds you know and uh what he was regular champion or super champion 135 regular champion at 140 so i mean if lamont move if he beats javante now he got belts in two different weight classes but we'll have to see about that but i just want to get my quick thoughts about it i'll break down the individual interviews i know they doing them right now so i'll be back shortly with more videos but let me know what y'all think